Jeans, 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 jeans. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It is me, Jess. And today I wanna to talk about my one true love, jeans, yes. So I need to tell you a story because my one true love, my all time favesy wavesies jeans are dead. <laughs> My butt got too fat and they split open in the back and I can't find them anywhere. I had had them for years and years and years. They were Joe's jeans, they were boyfriend, like ankle capri, they were all destructed and they were so soft and cozy. But like I said, my butt got super fat and just ripped right up the butt crack area. <laughs> no one wants to see that. So now I'm stuck with two backups, pairs of jeans that I Love, 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 love so much. The first pair I'm wearing, that's my leg. These are Paige Stretch Skinnies. I don't remember the name of them. I can't read my butt tag. They are so great because they're like halfway between a jegging and just like a jean, which I kind of really like. Because jeggings, I kind of feel like you have to get just the right ones without them looking like leggings that look like denim. And then jeans are always just so stiff and uncomfortable. It's already bad enough that most of mine are cutting into my love handles and around my waist giving me a little fat tire. I don't want that like sensation all over my legs and my butt and my thighs, especially my thighs. I really like these because they're soft but firm. I like my jeans like I like my men, soft and firm. Oh, <laughs> My second favorite backup pair, because my Joes don't exist anymore, are these true religion jeans. I just really like these because I've also had these for years and years and years and they're softy, but they're slim legs, they're not skinny legs. They wear in really easily. And if you haven't noticed by now, all my favorite jeans are designer jeans. And that is for one reason and one reason only. I have 19 million mile long legs and I'm fortunate enough that they are quite slender legs. That means I can't really buy like Old Navy or Target. Like I can't buy that grade of jean or denim because they're always either super short or the waist size I need. They're super baggy in the legs and so I can't find a happy medium. So my friends turned me on to designer jeans I think back in high school and I've never looked back since. I think it's worth it because like these jeans were like $85 but I bought them four years ago and they still work great. They're still making it work. Uh. Ooh, it's making me gassy. Okay, don't throw up. You're gonna pass out now. I wanted to share with you my love for my jeans, my one true love for my jeans, because my friends, Megan and Wendy of Long Story Short, they started this monthly prompt where you can make content, any kind of content, and it could be an Instagram, it could be a blog post, it could be a video, it could be whatever you want it to be, about your favorite thing. And so January's prompt was jeans, so that was pretty easy for me to say, I'm gonna tell people about the jeans I love. And I know some of you who have experienced me in real life are like, what are you talking about? You love jeans. Anytime I've seen you in person, you're always wearing leggings or that dumb oversized wombat lady onesie that everyone was buying off of Amazon a year ago. And you're right, mostly, most of the time I'm wearing <laughs> spandex close, right? Leggings and things or oversized things that are nondescript and don't hug my body. But on the rare occasion, like today, when it's freeze your tatas off outside, I will put jeans on because they're a little bit warmer on the leg region. So I'm gonna leave the link to the blog post that has the nifty swifty graphic of all the prompts coming up in the month. And I think it just could be really fun. We could learn about some of our favorite things. I think that the world could stand to use us talking positively about the things that we love instead of negative negatively about the things that we hate, right? Right, exactly. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already because it's a party when I'm here and then you're here and we're here and then we party and that's so much fun. Follow along the hashtag for this whole favorites series that Megan and Wendy are doing. I love you to the moon and back and I will see you guys next time. Okay.